out it. Like how they know we ain't talking, that ain't they business. Know when we fussing and fighting, you tell your friends them. But if you wondering if I love you, yes I do. But if you wondering if I need you, yes I do. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl Tay Tay, and I am back again with another video for you guys. Um, yeah. Before you get into this video, please follow me on. No, please like, comment, share, subscribe. Please follow me on all my social media. She's stupid thick with two Ks. Follow me on TikTok. She's stupid thick. And yeah. Get right to the video. Um, Mr. CJ. Mr. CJ, so cool. This today's topic is about CJ. CJ, so cool. CJ, um, yesterday was the twins' birthday. He didn't get to see the twins. He bought gifts. He bought balloons, he bought cake, and he didn't get to see them. Well, you know what I'm saying? So, we all know the story of CJ and Royal Team. They've been together for eight, nine years. We've been watching their vlogs, their videos. He's been. Helping her raise her kids. Um, uh, he has another daughter that he was out of her life. She came back into his life. Um, she would come to visit from time to time. Court ordered. You know what I'm saying? He would go get into it with his baby mama, Nike. Um, he would cheat on royalty. Um, he would be like very like talking crazy to the kids in the videos. Like CJ, he CJ is a lot. He he's a lot. Now he's with Lexi. I actually I like Lexi. People was always oh that white girl, that white girl, that white girl. I mean, her being white really doesn't ha have to, nothing to do with nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like she's. You know, a person. I think she's there for CJ. She's been helping him out, you know, since he... Even, especially since he got shot. She's been there for him, cooking for him. And if Lexi could put up with CJ... Because even CJ is a lot for me, and I don't even know him. Through the camera, he's a lot. He just... It just... It, it, it never stops. It never stops. It never stops. But this is about CJ not seeing his twins. Yeah, he put... Royalty through a lot. He cheated. He's talking crazy to her, talking crazy to the kids, telling all their business. Like, just a lot. You know what I'm saying? But, Royalty's right at this point, we're going to talk about right now. We're not going to talk about the past because we all know about the past and the uh, Nike and Royalty, the fighting, the uh, the kids like not liking Kamari, which is his daughter. Kamari not liking some of them. It's just like it just was like it's been a back and forth things for years and years. We're all we're pretty much over it. Like let's move on. CJ's with um uh Lexi. Um him and Nike are are cool. Um Royalty, she's moved on with her kids. Her kids don't like CJ. Her older kids don't like CJ. Um She seems to move on move on. She's with some other dude named Rico. On Valentine's Day, and then she was on live talking to another dude. It's like, like she, CJ said, you know, CJ tells everybody's business. That's around that tells him anything that she got. She got like a plethora of dudes. She got like four, five, you know, six of them. She's living. She's dating. She's single. She could do what she want. Her kids are, you know, well taken care of. They, she has older siblings. She has a mom. She has a brother. So the kids are taken care of. She can go do whatever she want to do when the kids are home safe. Um, CJ, he's with, um, Lexi, he can do what he want to do at this point, and, yeah, whatever, boom, let's get to, it's the twins' birthday, okay, before, like, last week, a couple of weeks ago, he said, oh, I talked to, uh, Royalty, and she said, 
I could see the twins. I could be in, um, what I want to do with the twins for their birthday. I'm invited. But then he said after that phone call, he had already made a video, but then he had just put it out. And then after that, he didn't hear, he didn't hear nothing else from him. So he was still buying stuff, still doing, still video, every video. I hope I get the twins for the birthday. I'm not getting no response. I hope I see the twins for the birthday. And yesterday was the birthday. And I guess he didn't get to see the twins, you know, because of, you know, the stuff that was, that was said. So it's whatever. Um, I understand that we all, not we all, I understand that royalty may feel a certain type of way about him, just like he feels a certain way about her. But for the kids, you have to let all that stuff go. Royalty could have let CJ see them twins. Roy CJ didn't do nothing to his kids. He didn't do nothing to them. Things didn't work out with you. He may say things about you, but just because you're upset with him, you can't take it out on those babies. It's not right and it's not fair. You, Royalty made a whole video and she was bashing Nike, uh, Nike talking about, oh, you only, you hold Kamari from CJ and you hold her as a chick and you dang like you're doing this the same thing the same thing that you said she's done the same thing you said that she do you're doing it except that kamari's older kamari has a phone she has you know an ipad she can call her dad she can know her dad's number if she's not with her mom or if her mom has issues she could still get in contact with her dad if she wants to the twins don't have that choice. Twins don't know how to pick up a phone and say, oh, let me call my daddy. They're not thinking about that kind of stuff. They're thinking about playing and naps and bottles and cookies and this and that. That is it's not right. It's not right and it's not fair. But this is another thing. Do we really feel sorry for CJ? Do we? Because Murti has three other kids and y'all did the same thing to their daddy <laughs> same thing I, same thing with him i seen him uh, was it last year was it the last year or the year before he went to uh, i seen him go to the grocery store and buy a cake for Julia on her birthday did he get to talk to her no did he get to see her no he had to do the same thing you're doing CJ have a cake dedicated to his child that he didn't get to see or talk to or nothing why because y'all let royalty be in control. CJ, it's not even about, like, we can't even use, like, the shooting, like, oh, maybe she doesn't want them around because the house isn't safe. Me, personally, I would move. He, if you want to sit around with guns in every other spot and just ready for somebody to come in, like, I don't think that that's, that's the way somebody would want to live. Like, that's uncomfortable. That's, that's weird. You're just looking for, you know, I wouldn't, me, I would just move, start over, start fresh. Make sure I have the proper security. Make sure I have this, this, and this, and this. And then that's that. To make, because you do have three, you know, young children that you want to come to your house and feel safe. So I don't think I wouldn't still be there and live there. I wouldn't feel safe there. I wouldn't feel safe bringing my kids there or letting my kids be there, personally, me. But that's what you want to do, cool. Yeah, I don't have to, the kids don't even have to come to his house. She was... Excuse me. If she was really uncomfortable, she could say, "CJ, maybe you could get an Airbnb for a week, get a um hotel for a couple of days, and then the kids could come there." But yeah, she's withholding these children because I'm sorry. She's withholding these children because that's what you know. what I'm saying. I guess that's her. That's her thing. She, things don't work out with a dude. She got kids. You can't see him no more. And the best thing for the CJ to do is see uh, everybody always talking about, I don't, I don't want the white man in my business. I don't want the course in my business. Okay, but sometimes that's what you got to do when you're dealing with people that don't know how to communicate. Excuse me. If I was him, I'd go to court. I'd get everything in writing. I said we could meet up at the police station. And that's that. I go put myself on child support. It's just like it's certain stuff you gotta do, cause like 
you seen what she was doing to the other dude. So why do you think that you was going to be different? Because you had money. What it was, he, he thought that they never was going to leave. Because he had, you know, money. But you, 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 you just doing YouTube. She could go do the same thing. Like she's doing now. Get her own, her own house, her own place. Make her own videos with her kids. And then now she's good. So they don't need your money. They don't need nothing from you. But, you know, now she's with holding the babies. And it's messed up. So instead of crying on the internet, telling everybody, all the internet, all your problems, how you feel, blah, 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 it's Friday. You should be getting up right now, today, going out to the court building, filing for, um, custody um what you call it split cuff custody half because whatever is i don't know you know custody just file for visitation or whatever because it's not just they're not just her kids i mean you know what i'm saying so i mean you gotta do what you gotta do if you sit around and let somebody else um have control over your kids i mean she's she has the rights to do whatever she wants if you and just gonna just let her do it so stop whining stop crying don't make no video about it i'm waiting to see if you're gonna make a video today you're gonna be like oh i can see the twins okay all them gifts and all that stuff you got keep it keep it and wait till you get your um wait till you go to the court they're gonna give it to you you're not a bad dad you're not doing anything wrong you you just all you, you really guilty of is just you run your mouth too much. That's about it. But you gotta get yourself together. You know what I'm saying? So you just gotta go with the flow. That's all you can do at this point. Go to court. Go to court. Get your you know that paper that says when you can see out when you can see and when you, when you can't. Because, obviously, I can't come to a mutual agreement of, you know, visitation for the twins. So, that's what you got to do. Because, is she can't tell you, like, if, like, I'm sorry. Um, Kamari was around, was around, uh, royalty and her kids all these years. You know what I'm saying? And Nike didn't know what was going on. When she wasn't there, it was always a problem. Just like with, with the lasagna and with the Jalea and them on live making videos. Her daughter still had to go down there because it was court ordered. Had to go when she didn't want to go for the summer, even though she wanted to stay with her friends. She still had to go. And Royalty, you made a video about it saying, oh, she's welcome here. Is this? Oh, I know how she move. I know how cool. Like you sitting there was talking about a child like she was a grown woman. And she still went down there and y'all had a good time, right? It was family time, right? So he's been with Lexi for a while. Him and Lexi been together for a few months. That's his business. Long as she's not hurting your kids she's not like putting him in any danger you can't tell him his girl can't be around his kids you that's not your choice you chose to leave you with a whole nother dude whenever you see fit to bring your kids around that dude like your kids they see him on facetime even though you probably ain't putting the camera in their face they know who he is they know his name like that that's just it's just it's giving bitter so, CJ, you need to go to court and do what you got to do. Stop whining to the internet. What can we do? You telling us, do we? You put on the story. Do, oh, I didn't get to see my twins. Do I deserve to see my kids? Am I a good dad? We don't know. It's not up to us. Like, go handle your business like a man and go to court and get your rights and go sit down. Because basically, we tired of hearing it. If not, let Royalty have all the authority like she has and then let it go and then leave us out of it. Because we don't know if you deserve to have your kids or if you're a good dad or whatever. Of course, your supporters are going to say, oh, yeah, 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 of course. Because they think you, the kids, YouTube is like mostly kids. So they see you buying your stepkids or whatever, all these gifts and stuff. So they think that getting things and stuff and clothes and shoes, that's being a good dad. But it's really not. It has, material things has nothing to do with it. But I do feel like he, you love your kids. 
You want to be around your kids. You want to be with your kids. Even if it's just for content, he still want to be it's still his kids. So if that's what he want to do, royalty, stop hating. Let that man see his kids. But if she don't want to, go to the court. Get your paper. You can have your kids around whoever you want when it's your time. And she can't say nothing or do nothing about it. And that's just that. End of story. Go to court. Get your stuff together. That's it. But that's the end of this video. If you guys have any suggestions or requests, please put it in the comment section down below and I get to it as soon as I can. It's the end of this video. Uh, follow me on Instagram. She's stupid thick. 2Ks. Follow me on TikTok. She's stupid thick. And yeah, that's the end of this video. And I'll be back in here with another for you guys next time. Peace. You know I love you. I was talking to Tay Tay.